Alright, welcome to this YouTube video, and today I'm going to show you how I made my very own compressed air cannon. So I constructed the stand out of a 2x8 and some 2x4s. I ended up using wheelchair wheels on the stand because they bolted on and they were easy to put on. Okay, here's the pressure chamber where the compressed air is stored. Now we're going to follow it up. Here is the gauge in the fill valve. The pressure chamber connects to the sprinkler valve, then it goes into the breech of the cannon. Here's an example of loading the cannon. For the elevation system, I have two rods that guide the cannon vertically. The bolt is unscrewed and then tightened to control the angle of the cannon. So here is our missile. This is a FireTech Arrow. This is an old missile I had from the bow and arrow kit and this is nice because it fits the bore fairly close. All I had to do was shave this part down for it to fit in. And the best thing about it is, is that it lights up. So in nighttime, you can shoot this and you can see it go through the air like a tracer around. And it's very easy to find at night as well. And here's the firing test. Alright, so we found the missile. This thing went super far. I don't really want to show my house, but I'll show a little glimpse of it. It's pretty much way over there. So after previous shots, this sand pit is about 160 yards away. I have an online map that I used to measure it, so that was pretty cool. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you leave all your questions in the comments because this video is a lot to take in and I would like to do a Q&A about the canon in the next video. Make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss it.